We got action, y'all. We got action. Stephen A. Smith goes in on Jada Pickett Smith. Check it out. That's your son's friend. It's tri You want to mess with some dude? That's your son's friend. It's trifling as that may seem in people's eyes. That's your damn business. You want to break up with your husband and all of this yeah. stuff? That's your business. But this public emasculation needs to stop. Jada, all you're doing is elevating the level of vitriol coming your way. Because it don't matter what you say. There's nothing, there's nothing you can say to a man to justify what you have done to Will Smith. Shit. Every time I see Jada's biggest Smith talk about Will Smith, I cringe. Woo. We kings. We kings. We ain't here to be treated like that. You're queens and you shouldn't be treated like that either. And I get that. Tell me anywhere, biblically, scripture-wise, in any scripture, where it encourages you to publicize your personal business for profit when it negatively affects your spouse. You want to mess with some Wow. Now, this might be one of the times... <laughs> Well, I can't even say one of the times I agree with Stephen A. Smith because I don't be disagreeing or agreeing. I don't really pay him that much attention, to be honest with you, that I think about it. Although I do know, I have noticed that a lot of people that I watch and stuff like that, they always bring him up in a negative light or like something going on with all the different things with him. But this is one of those situations to where as He's actually right. I mean, like, where do we end at? And this is like one of my, I ain't gonna say fears, but this is like one of those situations to where I always thought to myself, I would never want to have a woman or a situation to where a woman, like if I'm in the spotlight, she's looking for that, that cry out, I ain't gonna say cry out for help, but that whole just I want to humili humiliate you and I don't care I don't care what you putting out there I want to put out my narrative that's supposed to be bigger than yours and we, it's like it's basically a challenge like if, if you're really looking at Jada Pickett Smith she's really competitive I mean it's something inside of her it's, it's like something going on in that household that makes her, she want more attention than Will. She's definitely love attention. This whole campaign or whatever she's on, if you look up and just keep being another story here and there about Tupac, she's talking about Tupac, she's talking about how Chris Rock tried to talk to her after I was on a date. All, all of this press she want for this book this book she got coming out, or that's out or whatever. I mean, this is press right here, no matter what the number is. People, she's in the conversation. But over the years, with just being with Will Smith, it, it's, it's not hard to tell that she's maybe jealous of his success. She feels entitled because she's the woman. So it's like she's dating a man who's a mega superstar. Y'all know who Will Smith is. I mean, everybody know who Will. She attached her name to Will Smith seemingly for that. She know how big Tupac is. She attached her, she keep trying to attach herself to Tupac name and legacy. I mean, for, for life. She wasn't even doing this that much when he was alive. So look at all these years later, but 27 years later, how she's still trying to attach her name to it. <laughs> This is sad. I mean, she even just went on to say the other day that Tupac was afraid to admit that he had alopecia too. I mean, she's really trying to just associate this man to any to her in any type of way. I mean, we under, if the book gonna sell, baby, the book is gonna sell. I mean, why do we have to go through this? And then the way she just keep treating Will, it's like.
it's like, okay, is he supposed to fight for it now? And I don't even know if that comment was true or not. When they post, she supposedly came out and said that they've been separated for seven years already. It just didn't know how to tell the masses and tell the world. So you mean to tell me when he smacked Chris Rock, he was just doing that? To, I mean, he was just doing that. I mean, we know why he was doing it because he was, you know, out of frustration and he was hurt inside no matter what. But you mean to tell me he knowingly already that y'all been separated, but y'all just out and you know, and just putting on the front for the world, and, and he damn near risked his whole career and smacked this man. Now, this, this is Will Fortnite. I ain't, I ain't saying this guy too much to do with Jada, but I'm just saying this how gone Will is that he did all that and he knowing it, that they not even really together like that. I mean, what energy is we living in to where Jada? I mean, she, she's basically in her own bubble. <laughs> and I think it's time for the fans in the world to just see that and just, and just let it be. But the sad part about it is she speaks for a whole community of women who just been taught not to never give up. Because she's disguised and all of this and inside of some type of self-awareness and self-pride for women. She's hiding behind that. So it's like the the narrative that she's pushing, she's she, she's trying to push a mass a masculine man agenda, but she's trying to sink it through to women who who don't even have the self esteem to to even see that. If this making sense, and if you if you, if you I mean it, it means it means y'all in the car with me where I'm going with this. <laughs> do you, do 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 you see? how she's trying to treat this man over and over. Every 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 other week is a new story for her to supposedly stand in line like, and it's kind of like the only way for her to flourish in life is to down will to make herself look better and to get to, I, I can just imagine the arguments I own when she's competing for the attention. I mean, you can already see it. But Will, he like, man, I need, because Will got the attention already. Will is a mega, super mega star. Jada, she got to pull these antics every day to, it's kind of like when a woman is online every day posting pictures or got bikini pictures up and it's only the same 50 people like it or something, but she, but she knows a whole nother 150 over there that's trying to ignore her. So she's doing it over and over because she's getting that gratification of being talked about. That's what Jada's at. After all these years, the book now, the TV shows now. I mean, I can see if I can see if all of doing all these things is. It, it's create some type of therapy within side, but it's not even doing that. It's more just downing someone. <laughs> That's all she's doing. And I'm pretty sure she see it by now. And unfortunately, it's a whole following for this because a lot of women is like that. Women, if they don't get that attention, they going crazy. I didn't see it. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't been on the opposite end of it. I didn't been through breakups and the woman spreading lies and, or 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 trying to bring up things after it's over with to try to destroy character. Some women really get into a dark place and they they do things like that. Why you think all of a sudden they just they just say somebody gay or? Somebody thing small, somebody can't have sex. And all. why do you think all this stuff or all of a sudden to come out of something after the relationship's over? Don't you know that's that's slander? That's you know. Jada know what that does to Will when she talk about Tupac publicly. You think she don't know that? 
she know that made Will curl it. Will Will didn't went public saying that he don't like when she talk about Pac. He didn't he didn't say it on the Brother Club that he was jealous of Tupac. He didn't say these words out of his mouth on public platforms. So if you got a spouse or the mother of your kids is steady running around speaking on somebody and it's something you can't do nothing about. Whether, whether it's sinking in to Will or not, she knows what she's doing. Now, I'll get with y'all in a minute, man. I, I, it's beyond me. She's competitive. That's what she is. Jada Pinkett Pink is, is competitive. So all she can do now is just talk about a man in the past, the way that can't even speak for itself. Post old pictures, got her kids writing letters and all this stuff. This is this is a fatuation. This is this is actually sad. But I get with y'all in a minute, though. Wrapped up. <laughs> 